What's up, good people? Welcome to Miles from India. As I continue to recover from shin splint injury, I'm trying to add whatever I can to my toolbox to make sure that I am coming back healthier and stronger. So on today's YouTube video, I am reviewing the Ufos Recovery Sandals. So check it out. What's up, good people? Welcome to my channel. If you are new to my channel, I am India. And if you're returning, what's up and welcome back. So if you have been watching my videos, I'll pop a video above telling you all about my shin split injury. Now, through this recovery and of course, just being around and not doing much running, I have been Googling everything in the world to find the best tools to put in my toolbox as a runner to ensure that I am recovering as best as possible after my runs and also ensuring that when I'm not running, I am doing recovery throughout that time and also just ensuring I can do the best things that I can throughout the process. So with having a PT, something that I actually learned is obviously, well, I didn't just learn this. This has been 30 plus years of knowing, but I have a really flat foot. So what that means is that when I'm walking around barefoot, cause your girl is a Southern chick, I walk around barefoot at home and I will go outside barefoot too. It's not the best for me as a runner with recovery, as well as someone that has really flat feet and I am trying to recover from shin splints. So I Googled and I said, what can I do to have a better slide that I can wear around the house? And especially something I can wear after running to make it better. And I came up with these the ufos recovery slide so in today's video i'm just going to take you through some pros and cons and let you know how i really like them so the first thing is of course a little bit of the specs so these are made of U foam which is a really really cushiony foam that i absolutely love um, and the foam and the way that these are designed are supposed to help to it is designed to take 37 percent of the impact that you take on every single step so that means whenever you are hitting the ground, the shoe is absorbing the impact and it is helping to take any pressure off of your knees, lower back, and as well as your calves and shins. So, you know, for me, I was like, you know what? I am sold on these. As soon as I put these suckers on, I felt like I was literally walking on clouds. They are so soft, very cushiony. Now, I'll be honest, after probably about three days of walking in them, I didn't get that I didn't get that, oh, it feels so good feeling, but they are very soft and cushiony to walk around in. Now, I will say I can tell a difference now when I walk barefoot versus when I walk in these. And as soon as I come home from taking off whatever shoes I had on, whether it be from running or just going out to run errands, I slide these suckers on. So I wear them around the house to give me that support that I need um, because they also have a supporting arch here and the cushion so that I am just not walking around barefoot. Now, of course, these help to reduce the stress off of your joints and your knees and lower back. And we need all of that. And I just realized like as I continue to get older, the injuries aren't taking care of themselves as quick as I would like them to be and I have to give a little extra now something that I also love about the shoe is that it is really lightweight it is something that is not a heavy clunker shoe um, even though it may look like it but it is not just to let you guys know Ufos definitely sells different types I like the flip-flop side slot sandal um, but they do sell other sandals that are actually um, a big piece here to where it's actually like the slide I prefer not to have those because for some reason I'm that girl that when I put my slides on, I like to grip the front of my sandal and that shit is it's just not cute. So we're going to go with the flip flops and keep it cute. All right, now to the pros and the cons. So let's start out with the cons first. So the first thing is they don't come in half sizes. So for me, um, I am an 11 size shoe and I'm 5'8", just to let y'all know I'm 5'8", so the 11 doesn't look crazy on me, but I'm a size 11 shoe, but I feel like I potentially could have gone to an 11 and a half. So if you're one of those people that really are in the half size area, this may not be the best for you, or you may have to size up and give a little bit of space. The next con is these are a little, what some people may say pricey. But for me, I feel like if we are going to spend $150 on sneakers, we need to also spend money on recovering our feet and our joints and everything else. The ones that I got, these are $49.95, but they also do have various other sizes. 
um, and colors and styles that are different costs. They do have some that are 70, excuse me, 69.95, which is 70 um, in other prices. And then they also have different colors that allow you to get them on sale. I know that I just checked the website and they had some for $30. So just depending upon what you like. And the last con that I have for this shoe is that they are super orthopedic looking, I guess. So they're not the cutest shoes, but I guess if you're walking around the house, who are you trying to be cute for? And the other thing is when you get done running, you're not trying to be cute. You're trying to be, you're trying to recover and do whatever is comfortable. So comfort over cuteness for these. And of course, let's get into the pros. So of course, my first one is the fact that they are recovery. They feel plushy and I'm actually, a, I know that they are offloading some of the pain for me. As soon as I put these on, I just really feel the release that I have on my body and I absolutely love it. The next ones are that they are lightweight. I love that they don't look as, he they don't feel as heavy as they look. They are soft, they're cushiony, they're lightweight, they're packable, um, and I can just take them wherever and it's not really a problem. Um, and then the last one is that they do have color variations. I am one of those people that I absolutely love um, having some variety, but at the same time, when it comes to most things, I like to stick with just black. So I only have black now, but I may add some extra ones to my collection. Right, so that's the review on the Ophos recovery slide. I will definitely give this slide a four out of five, and I honestly want to get another pair. Um, I was telling a friend of mine, it is definitely worth the purchase. It's one of those that you see them in the running store, but you're like, do I really wanna pay $50 for a sandal? You guys, I would say that it is absolutely worth it. I love it and I don't walk around barefoot anymore because of these suckers. So definitely check it out. Thank you all for watching my channel. I have other reviews on my page as well as other run related content. If you like this video, subscribe, give me a thumbs up and we'll talk to y'all again soon. Peace.